This particular bird bath is close to 14 years old. We like this one for the fact that it shows two different characteristics. The top bowl is the one that we treat each week. We dump them both out. This one, of course, we have to use with, with a scrubber, as everybody has been. Uh, this one, again, we use the rag simply for wiping the bowl out and then retreating. You will see that this one isn't as dirty as most bird baths will get because I do get a little overflow of product actually going down into this one. What's interesting is here you see the slime, the buildup, and the growth. A lot of people say, geez, why is my water brown or gray or has a tint to it? Anything within two miles of here blows on, onto this, these bodies of water. This is actually rust. We're up here, we're in Wisconsin, so we get a lot of uh, rust compounds in our atmosphere and also is in rain. And that's what you're seeing the buildup of is actually the mineral deposits and different other contaminants that will form in there. Again, it's the same procedure. We would simply dump these out, put in another capful of, of the bird bath protector. What's unique about the bird bath protector is it actually gets down, like Teflon, gets down into the cracks and crevices so that this stuff doesn't get down deep enough where literally I have to use um, harsh chemicals or scrubbing to get that clean.